Hello and good afternoon, everybody over at Pro Electric. My name is Josh Nelson here at Midwest Valley Marketing. I want to get this custom video sent over to you guys, showing you guys how you can increase sales and traffic to your guys' website. So with that being said, we're going to jump right into it here. All the things, all the nit grit that we need to do in order to start getting that. First things first, I see you guys right up here. You guys are not a secure website. I would definitely recommend doing this. This is a about ninety-six to one hundred dollars a year um, to secure everybody's, you know, information on your guys's website. You guys have a contact form, so we want to make sure that everybody's information is safe. Also, you guys have a beautiful site layout here. I have, I love this photo. Please tell me you did this because that is so badass. Um, not to mention all your other guys' work that you guys have done is probably freaking awesome. Uh, I think we can scroll through it here. Nope, this isn't. This just shows a few other things. But most of all, really good website. I see you guys have all your service pages here. Uh, we can go in each one of them, but I'm not going to sit here and analyze too much. One thing I do see that you guys don't have a ton of content, which is a letdown for Google. Google loves content. They will rank you better for having more content, content being this kind of stuff right here, right? We want keyword rich content as well. So one thing we can do in order to figure out how much content or how many keywords you guys are currently targeting on your website is by going and taking your URL and putting it into here. This is my tool I like to use. This is called Arifs. You can kind of analyze what you guys have for keywords currently, well, what you guys are getting for traffic on those keywords specifically, and maybe what keywords we want to have on our website, right? So a few of the things we got, search volume 1100 right there, get your name, Pro Electric, uh, Professional Electric Contractors, that's a good one at 150. Um, electric Pro, Pro Electric, a lot of it's your guys' name, which tells me you're probably doing traditional marketing currently, which is great. You always want to be doing all kinds of marketing that you can possibly do in order to get your name out everywhere. But that is what, to me, is what great is great about digital marketing. We can really, really, really target everything that we're looking for, right? And we want to compare that to our top competition in your guys' area. And that right now is Jeremy Electric. These guys are absolutely blowing it online. They have a super unique site. Um, but then again, they're lacking all the content they could possibly lack, right? So we want to figure out what they're doing for numbers. I um, believe you guys were getting roughly 150 organic traffic. You know, once you really start putting backlinks and keywords into your guys' website, these are the possibilities of what you guys can reach. I mean, the sky is limitless with this stuff. It's awesome. You can just continually add more, and all it's going to do is help you and help you. Um, so we're going to go and focus on these keywords, though. See what these guys are getting for traffic to their keywords. Similar to you guys, but they have some more service-based ones, right? Elect electrical questions, overland park, electrical questions, questions, local electricians, um, less summit electricians. You have 500, 300, 500, 500, 8,800 for local electricians, 2,200 for local electricians, Kansas City electricians, 400. You know, they're all the kind of keywords are just one niche off, but... The more that we can offer into our website, the better our chances are. I think just with these couple alone, they're grabbing over 15,000 traffic every single month. We also want to go in and analyze their backlinks. We want to have lots and lots of backlinks, but not just any kind. We don't want just any kind of backlinks. There's some really spammy ones that will fall off and actually hurt our rating. We want to get good quality backlinks. Um, good quality backlinks are going to be good citations, good guest posts, good link juice and influence. We can go on, same thing as the keywords. We can figure out every single one of the backlinks that these guys are grabbing. We can almost copy and paste it ourselves, right? We want to go out and we want to put these, attach these to some content. Some These are no follow links here. We can attach it to an image. Um, there's, I mean, limitless possibilities with how we can attach these backlinks, but we want to make sure that we have them. Not to mention also, we want to optimize our Google business profile. You guys are currently sitting right here at eight reviews with 10 plus years in the business. That's great. You guys only have one photo and it doesn't even show what you guys have actually done. Maybe put some photos in here that really show, hey, this is our work. You know, come take a look at this. Uh, See, so you guys have an address. Uh, don't have a whole lot of information here. You guys don't even have an about section, right? We can compare to the number one guys up on the Google My 
your Google business profile right now when we search something like this, electricians, Kansas City, Missouri. Google ads are a great way to get up there as well. You have Google ads right here. But we're talking about Google My Business profiles right here. Mr. Sparky, 713, right? AD's Team Electric, I have no idea how these guys are here. I, I know they were running an ad a couple days back, um, but these guys are most likely going to fall off here in a little bit. Uh, 360 reviews for Jeremy Electric, so we definitely want to boost our reviews and you know match kind of everything that these guys are doing. Everything from... They got their website, request a quote option right here, shows the area, their location, um, all their services, and they have a good about section as well. So with that being said, I know it's a bunch of awesome information, but I highly recommend, first things first, is getting the site secure. That way people's information is protected. I know it was a lot. Appreciate you sticking with me for the last six minutes. Hope you guys found this information helpful. If you guys want, feel free to reach back out, give me some feedback, what you thought about the video. I'd be happy to follow up with you. All of my contact information is attached in the email. Thank you guys. Have a great day.